So what's been your worst crash and where was it? Oh man, I don't like these questions. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't have any bad crashes. That's good. <laughs> That's sweet. Yeah. But Alaska spooks you out a little bit, some of the spines and whatnot? Well, it's just, it's really fun and definitely is one of my favorite places. Obviously, I love going up there. Um, but it's just very different, right? You know, when you're at home, it's all just good times, laughing, having fun up there. It's definitely a lot of intense moments, and you know, you're not. It's you know, not stressful, but it definitely you're using the helicopter is very like it's loud and you know it's a scary machine in some ways, right. and a very serious machine. So everything you do around it and protocol and stuff is very. Um, Serious, kind of. So is there like a lot of choreography that you have to do between, say, the cameraman on the helicopter and what you're going to be doing? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, there's a lot of like the setup going into each shot is like there's, there's so much behind the scenes stuff from usually a, a you know kind of simple breakdown is we fly to an area, we, we're either we, an area we know we kind of want to go look at or something we see and we stop, we land near there, we get out with our guide and we make a run kind of in the area and assess the snow and then we meet up with the cinematographers and, and photographers and talk about who wants to go where, kind of describe where we're going to ski and then um, from there we all kind of make a plan with, with that, you know, kind of choreography basically that okay, so-and-so is going to go first, they're going to go next because of either light or snow conditions or the way, you know, it would best be filmed or photos. So um, there's a lot of setup that g going into that. We all have radios, and so we kind of use radio communication once we're on the slope, once we're in position. You know, the helicopter, usually if it's filming, they do test runs, so they'll fly around a few times, not shooting, kind of talking with the heli pilot because really when the pilot's like a flying camera so right. the camera guy is, is at that point just you know the heli pilot shooting and <laughs> right because he's got to be in the right position yeah to shot totally so sometimes it takes a few times so sometimes it might be like an hour hanging out before you know at the top of the run before you want yeah because and a line might take a few minutes to film they need to you know reload film right so definitely there's a lot of behind the scenes stuff and so it takes some, some patience and stuff as well, but then there's a big payoff, so. For sure. Cool, man.